Hey guys, welcome back to Twitchy Plays XCOM Enemy Unknown, where we will not stand for space tourism. We have had enough of these people coming here, flaunting all our border controls and just landing where they like. Uh, so we have been set up to, to, to sort this out. I mean, oh, it, it, may, it boils my blood, it really does. All these people coming along. I mean, they don't even spend any of their space bucks around here. It, it's totally unacceptable. But what is acceptable is we've just built a foundry, and that sounds amazing. Tell me what it's about, guys. Tell me what it's about. No, no, we're not actually going to get any description here. Let's just uh, put a, a new new uh, facility in. Uh, what what do we want to do? Well, we've got the foundry. I swore these two work together. We don't have the uplink plus thing here that we needed. So what I need to do anyway is put some power generation in. So let's let's have a look down here. What what are we missing? Funds. Of course, we're missing funds. So basically, all we need to do is wait then. Uh, maybe go to the grey market and sell some stuff I saw over here. Oh, we've got a pending request. What do we need? Uh, nanofiber vest. Can complete. Got some hours left, but that's okay. Uh, I was going to leave that to see what happened. I remember now. Uh, we've got 36 sectoid co corpses. I don't think we really need this many. So if I, if I sell enough to cover the, the building costs, about that many. Ooh, complete transaction. Brilliant. What else do we have here? So we have some damaged stuff. Item can be sold freely because it's damaged. Um, again, no, no one's corrected me about this. I mean, it says so here, so I'm just just going to assume that it, this is right. Yeah, alloy is lovely. Alright, let's complete this transaction and get on out of here. Uh, so we need to research... We've got some vets on our side. It takes a serious pair to go face to face with one of those things. Yeah, indeed. Ch cheers for interrupting me, though. I mean, whoa. Uh, we need to get to yeah, here, build, f build the facilities, throw up the power generation. Brilliant. Begin construction. The next thing we need to do is get satellites running in a big way. Um, I really want to get most of these done. Let's have a look in the, in the foundry. It's not the prettiest, but some of our more interesting projects will certainly benefit from the adjustments made down here. So I have no idea what any of this does, so uh, let's have a look. Uh, heavy weapons platform, the super heavy, super heavy infantry vehicle is an unmanned combat drone that could be taken with the place of one XCOM soldier. Wait! Wait, we're not doing this. Let's get, get out of here. We need to go to the situation room, was it? No, barracks, sorry. Barracks, officer training school, and it is about time. Boom! We put our squad size up. That really had to have gone done. Um, I'm, I'm glad about that. So coming back out, we seem to have a lot more money than I actually expected to have after buying the uh, power generation. So yeah, I'm not sure what's going there. Let's go back to the foundry. So that's pretty good, but what, what else have we got? We can improve the pistol. What are the most early developments in foundry? Um, Oh, come on, give, it, give, us the, give us the short synopsis of it. Utilizing the latest in composite materials, this upgrade will significantly improve the odds of scoring a critical hit on their targets. What, for all pistols? Like, I mean, like, literally all pistols. My plasma pistols, my laser pistol, any pistol, right? I hope. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. Just, no, I'm not sure if that's really what we want. Um, Anyway, we are so short of money, I'm actually going to have a look around see what else we can do. Because uh, there are things we wanted, I believe. Um, but I can't remember off the top of my head what they were. We've got two Phoenix cannons here, that was something we needed to do. So let's go to the hangar. Hey there, let's have a look at the, th at the ship list. Let's get to the Raven one. When selecting a specific jet within the hangar, you can choose to modify its current weapon loadout to best serve our needs. Well, that was what I was trying to do. And I want to have a look at this. The Phoenix can uh, cannon is capable of de delivering massive burst damage, but its limited range puts the interceptor at great risk. So, to me... Let's have a look at what this says. Uh, hit chance 17, 95. This is, this is good. Fire rate rapid, but the range is so short. I don't know, let's try it. I mean, what do we have to lose apart from an interceptor? Um, now, if anything happens within the next day, I think we might be in a bit of trouble. But I, I, we can deal with that. And we've got um, avalanches everywhere else. I mean, where do you reckon is more important to, to put another one? I don't know. As we've got two vehicles... No, nope. nope. we didn't want to do that. We want to come here and edit load out and put that there. Will you shut up, please? I don't want to talk to you, mate. Alright, let's get back to mission control. Let's get back to mission control and continue scanning. Uh, we're going to be getting some new armor soon. This will be good. Uh, hopefully we're going to get enough. Uh, there's all everything ticking in. That's good. So we want to uh, research some new armor. Brilliant. This is something we should have saved a lot of money for. Did I save the money for it? I can't remember. Um, so we can make some armor. Brilliant. What are we going to... I was going to say what are we going to research next, but blatantly we are doing this outside of Shard. So let's get in there. Why are you 
use such advanced technology against innocent civilians? Because they're evil. We've, we've been through this. I mean, I don't understand why people won't listen to me. We didn't want to do here, did we? We wanted to go here and try and build some more, more armor because my people, all my people. Uh, where do we build the armor? Is it here? It's here. Awesome. Can we build? We can build four as well. We really wanted to build five. Um, why won't it let me do this? One, two, three, four. Ah, look at that. Mm, where can we get 20 funds from? Because we're going to have five, um, five people, right? Uh, five soldiers. So we need to sell up some stuff. Um, like that. Let's just, let's just sell a load, shall we? As long as we're not selling more than we've got, that should be alright. I hope. That, that, that's how it works, right? That's got to be how it work, works. Alright, so, setup is taking a long time today. Um, th this is fine, but there we go. 60 alloys. Brilliant. Do it. Submit the order. But, like, the armour is a must. Um, out of all the things that I could possibly do, making it sure that my guys don't die instantly from chrysalids, uh, yeah, that, that's that's totally what I want to be able to do. Okay, off to mission control again. And we're just going to carry on waiting for these things to, to click by. Probably going to get the council report next. Uh, let's just see if there's anything we can do here. In fact, there's nothing I want to build. There is nothing I want to build at the moment. The money is just too tight. <coughs> All right, here we go. Transmission decoder. We need to click a button here, Steve. Extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we've heard all this before. So we, we've done a lot of good stuff here. I am really worried about these four four people here, and I'm not sure what I can do about it. Uh, I'm thinking the satellite coverage is probably going to help. I can't get enough up to, to do anything about it. Uh, anyone has any like tips for me at this point, I would just so greatly appreciate it. I, I've got a feeling there are things I've done that irreversibly damaged this. Um, we so. will be in touch, Who knows? Who knows? Just carry on scanning. Maybe we'll get something interesting. Maybe we'll just get this crystal shard thing. Let's see what they have to say about it. I, I, I don't know what they're going to really tell us. Uh, probably how to kill it better. I hope it's how to kill it better. Ooh, it shows locations, does it? And a loading screen. Well, it's good to see that bar panning across is universal. Do we have an eagle over these coordinates? Recon satellite Delta Two is just coming into line of sight now, sir. What coming could it be? Screen. Mountains? Nothing. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. No, that's impossible. I know it's there. So uh, Klingons were shielding, right? Thermal. Oh yeah, it's just gonna show out like that. Oh look, they can they can like scan them, uh, cover themselves up with like vis from gotcha. visual sights, but no, uh, not not the thermals. Think of what we might find once we get inside. Are we going? Facility. Oh no! Imagine what they might be doing down there. Yeah, well, imagine I'm what they're sure doing to people. We'll oh, I hit the microphone okay, there. We found it. Now, how do we get inside? Well, we just I walk along. You'd never ask. All right, we turn up and. Oh, it's obviously something to do with the crystal. Is it also a key as well as an antenna? Is this now the, the thing that's going on? Uh, so let's re assign you some research. involved in creating these crystals. An organic machine capable of complex communications. We could spend years studying this technology. Uh-huh. I could spend years reading this out, but I don't think I'm going to. At some point I need to come back and read all this in my own time. But, uh, new item available, the skeleton key. This device is a combination of a research into the shard uh, recovered from an alien outsider. It should allow troops to infiltrate an alien base and find out what's going on inside. So we need to... Oh, excuse me. We need to build one of those, do we? Uh, now, do we want to do some autopsies? I think we want to do some autopsies. They, they would probably help. Uh, things like the floaters, like straight up, we need to do an autopsy on that. Uh, all these other things. I mean, oh, it'd be nice to get skeleton suits and stuff like that on the go, but no, let's, let's do the, the autopsy. Go. Uh, we will be back to find out what's going on like that as long as we have a quiet couple of days here. Uh, alien, but what can we do that right now? Is that something we do right now? Let's Commander, have a look. We can begin working on a way to access the alien base as soon as you give the word. So we need the skeleton key. Should we at least go see how much it costs to build one of these? I've got a hunch as to how we might get into that facility. Just give the word, and I'll begin manufacturing the key immediately. <laughs> Be, be on with it then. Um, well, we can only do one, so we're going to have to have one. The potential um, applications for this sort of tech would have been limitless if the aliens had only come in peace. I know, I know. If only they didn't want to just take over our beaches and make themselves more important. Detected. 
Oh, well, here we go. A UFO has landed. Let's do this. It looks like we're going to go into the base next uh, next episode. I'm going to have to do this now. Um, all right. Thankfully, everyone should be back. Who have we got here? We've got Pedersen here and Turk. Ah, oh, th this is amazing. Now, we need to get Pedersen some better stuff. Uh, but I don't think we actually have the money at the moment, do we? I'm, I'm not sure. Let's, let's have a look at the loadout. Uh, arc, ah, second arc thrower, right? That's brilliant. Right, give us some armor. This new body armor was developed using what we learned from the alloys employed in the alien ship. It should prove to be both lighter and stronger than anything we've used in the past. Oh, good for you, buddy. Good for you. Um, can't do anything about the weapons. No, shotgun or assault rifle. Well, I want her to have the shotgun. Pistol. Can't even give her a plasma pistol yet. Um, that's a bit annoying. She she is the one that deserves it. Uh, and uh, do we keep the arc thrower on her just in case, or do we want to just give her a, a, a nano fiber and, and let her get on with it? Let's let, let's do that. Bam, full power. Yeah. Okay. Good work, Pedersen. Let's um, also have a look at Williams. We're going to have to go around and do everyone really for the armor, aren't we? Pow. Nice. And he's fully laid it out for everything else. That's good. That's good. Good. Edit unit, load out, armor, brilliant. Um, Nakagawa, I mean, if anyone doesn't need it, it's you, but let, let's let's give him him so he doesn't cry. I mean, oh, what a whinge bag, eh? And finally, Fatima Turk. Oh, no. She really needs to get some stuff going because she is one of our front forward assault people. Okay, what, what's her name? All day. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what that could be referencing. All right, let's uh, let's move and see what we're gonna go, gonna face here. So it was a, a crashed UFO. Um, like we we've done this many many times before. Uh, hopefully it should be easy enough, right? Should be. Oh, we're out in the rules again. Reports indicate the UFO set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we all know this. He says this every time we come in. Oh, look, I saw the UFO back there. Never noticed that before, even if it, if it, if it was there. Um, okay, so that gives us an idea of where it is relative to the Sky Ranger, right? Hopefully, maybe. I don't know, we'll see what's going on. Can't really infer too much from, like, cutscenes, can we? Try and do that, and it'll lead us to all sorts of trouble. Oh, I'm liking how many trees we've got. This is nice. Um, okay, so there's... There's some edges. There's a lot of edges. It's, a, it's another big map. It's another big map. Okay, so we're gonna have to. I don't know. Where do we go? Do we do we like claim a corner and, and make our way from there? And so we're starting with this guy anyway. So let's. Oh, I'd like to take a couple, oh, one step forward. Why not? Uh, okay, rounds are gonna be longer this this time. We've got five people to deal with. Nakagawa, uh, you can stay there for now. Doc Williams, you're coming in with um, with Odin over here. No, that's what we want. Uh, Turk getting right up and in, a, in the face. Let's go, go, go. Brilliant. No, that's not what I wanted to do. That's a little bit annoying. The, the main problem is I've, I've got it in my head that two is Overwatch and, you know, that doesn't always hold true. A little bit annoyed that we can't... Um, get full cover here that's, that's a little bit vexing but we're gonna we're gonna move her up as well and i think nakagawa can take his seat there brilliant and we're just gonna stick him with a pistol uh until we find out where he needs to be yeah that, that's a good plan good plans good good execution let's see what's gonna go on um no idea what's going on here so let's get our top two out first um oh look she can get full cover there don't really want to go running too far ahead. I mean, there's another set of full cover there. Let's see what let's see what we uncover if we run up here. Nothing. Okay, that's good. Uh, no, no, you, Miss Turk, you are not going that way. You're probably going to go. Eh, I don't know. I don't know. It seems a little bit. I'd like to get her up there actually. Let, let's let's actually go up here. Let's do it. Uh, that sounds like a plan. Sounds like a big plan. Um, right, Odin. These guys are going to start running down the middle, I think. All these three are just going to... So we'll have um, my assault guys kind of go down the side of this path, uh, either side of the path, and then we'll have all three walking down the middle. I say walking down the middle, making their way slowly down the middle, trying to keep cover on top on everyone. Should, should be good, I hope. I really do hope. I mean, all sorts of things could go wrong here. Uh, 
Where are we going from though? Where are we going from? Let's, let's let's get Doc in here. It's not the best cover we've got, but then they have to get no, they have to get through quite a few people before they can get to him. So it should work. Hopefully, it should work. We can hear something. What's making that noise? Oh, we've got we've got a group of floaters. Pedersen's on it. Oh, missed though. Right, so we need to rearrange our deployment to be a bit more square onto them. It's a little bit annoying that uh, I don't know. I'm not. I'm not sure what's annoying, but it's a little bit annoying. Them just coming in like that. No, no shot. Oh wow. Oh, get to it. Well, that's, that's amazing. Okay, so we've got a got our screen all the way over there for some reason. Okay, so let's figure out our assault um, assault people. Where 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 is she? Mr. Turk, you are in one of the worst places. Can we run and gun? No, of course not, because we wasted it last time. Uh, th this is why I, I, I hate when I do that. Um, it's almost exactly the reason why. But we're going to uh, hold it down. Well, can she shoot? No, not a 16% shot. She's not. Okay, let, let's have a look here. I, I don't really want to expose her out too much. So should we pop her back here? And then she's got full cover, right? Yeah, does that work? Maybe, maybe. Uh, so Marquez, he needs to start getting in with the holo targeting. So let's just uh, have a no, have a look at what we can shoot at. I mean, all these are pretty rubbish hits, but I'm going to go for this because then hopefully Nakagawa can get in with the snipe afterwards. We we, we can. That, that's my plan. That's my plan. The, the holo targeting's down. Nakagawa, here we go. Uh, and we want to headshot. Can we headshot? Fifty-eight percent. That's not great. Let's just save it on a. Oh, it's the same. Mm, do I use more more ammo doing that? No. Well, then let's just do the headshot, right? Hopefully. Uh, maybe I should save before he got close up. Well, it's two out of three down. That's good. And Doc Williams can't really do much. So let's get in close so she uh, he can provide sort of the the um, you know the bonuses to everyone around. Hopefully. I, th I think I think he does that. No, no one's corrected me yet, so that should be fine. Oh my god, we are swamped, swamped and swamped. What's he doing? He doesn't look like he's falling back, and it doesn't look like these guys are falling back either. Um, so once again, we, we should actually probably start with Marquez. Can we move him over this way? Be a bit more, a bit more proactive with it. I don't know. Yeah, let's 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 do it. Let's do it. You can't see anyone there. It's uh, so, so a little bit not quite what I was trying to do. Uh, squad sight fire. Hopefully, yeah, do it. Come on, Nakagawa. I know I make fun of you all the time, but you are getting better every day, mate. Better every day. Um, right. So now we want to get our assault team up over this way, right? Where are they? They just completely fallen back, like completely. That's not much fun. That's not much fun at all. Let's come over here. Yeah, this is who we were looking for. So they like de de despawned or something? I don't know. Did they stop being stop being over there? Well, how come I've only just uncovered them? What's the what's the deal with that? I'm not sure what the deal with that is. 48% is a pretty rubbish hit chance. <laughs> Nearly as bad as 24. Uh, let's do it. Oh wow! I was not expecting that at all. Not expecting that. Okay, little Miss DOA. Uh, can we get like behind here and fire? I think that might be a good one. Let's run and gun. Going in for the kill. You sure are, babe. You sure are, babe. Is that really what I want to say here? I don't think it is. I think she'd probably like kill me if I said that sort of stuff to her. Um, no, not Overwatch. That would be silly. Twenty-four percent to hit. All right, maybe we are going on Overwatch. Um, Doc Williams, let's get you over here with our sniper and just settle down to a quiet day, hopefully. One guy there, I mean, what's he going to do? What, honestly, what's he going to do? Reaction shot, he's running away, so let's have him. No, no, that's a shame. That is a great shame. So if he's cleared off my radar now... Am I in trouble? Uh, right, so LMG is going to go for a reload. I mean, look at this. This is terrible. We don't know where anybody is, so we're just going to quieten down. Oh, Miss Turk can see him. Where? 
no target so it's obviously a glitch that, that's annoying that's annoying that's very annoying actually I, I'd like to know these things um, so that's not cover that is cover it's pretty terrible cover though that that's also pretty terrible cover just just kind of moving forward really just slowly rolling on nah, nah, that's it's hella exposed I don't I don't like that at all uh, let's get into there get on the overwatch which is as as always slowly rolling forwards um, hopefully just keeping ourselves covered 